UNDP's commitment to support transformative projects has further been exhibited in the newly unleashed project for a hub geared towards business incubation in Kavali. The partnership with Kavale University has registered an extra 200,000 US dollars away from the initial 60,000 to support regional business incubation. According to LC, at a four UNDP country representative, universities have a crucial role in fostering innovations that can contribute to global transformation. I mean, things are moving so fast, especially innovation and digitalization, that you don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. We perhaps be flying now, I don't know, because artificial intelligence is there with us. It's so fast, robotics, machine learning, everything, mobile technology, things are going so fast every day, you don't know what to expect. But it's also a great opportunity for us to be able to do something in an era where we have technological advancement, digitalization, uh, innovation at speed. What can we do? And somebody, I, I was in Next Media the other day, and somebody was saying, look, shared a few things with me around giving <coughs> content creation. As per the university, the Regional Innovation Hub shall provide platform for innovative ideas befitting current market demands and still create markets for subsequent products. To provide workspace, mentorship, education, and access to funders, provide adequate resources, support obtaining of the intellectual property and support the commercialization of the innovations. Tourists will boost us and hope to take off and be able to move and develop it into a bigger long-term innovation center. While incense for seamless trans-African trade grows, as highlighted in the African continent of free trade area, this has been represented as a unique opportunity for the region's economic growth and development. Innovations linked to harness the potential of continental trade have been called for, positioned as drivers for continent change. Uh, I want to touch on the issue around trade. Uh, which is of a regional nature, particularly in the context of uh, the African Continental Free Trade Area Agreement. I don't know how many of you know about it, but African countries are saying enough is enough. Let's trade amongst ourselves. Yes. We have a 1.4 billion market. To the upcoming entrepreneurs and labor force, emphasis should be put on robust innovation, expanding the drive to other institutions for gross impact. As UNDP, if you can lend a hand, and you bring experts, and you bring those people to give testimonies who have uh, successfully made it in life through UNDP, then we can transform our nation and the youth. UNDP further evokes high institutions to design strategies that encourage creativity and yield actionable solutions that further link with sustainable development goals. The poverty levels are still very high, uh, still admit them. Uh, we still have huge gender gaps, and in fact, uh, the uh, study or the report that was launched by the Secretary General says, at this rate that we are going, it will take 281 years uh, for us to break gender gaps. And so we are far away from 2030. Um, we have a lot of people who are still using uh, fuels that are not uh, environmentally friendly, children are still not going to school, and we can go on and on and on. So that's one. At midterm, we are not doing well when it comes to the SDG, despite the progress that has been made substantially in some areas. Upon completion of the center, students and community at large await access to productivity workspaces, mentorship, education, and potential investors to support their innovative efforts. No, but in the Amhachi, Brenya Katsimesma, 2040V, Business Today.